What's up guys, it's Tom here and welcome back to a brand new Football Talk video and today's topic is Liverpool's owners, FSG and the big big announcement that they, they had the cheek to announce increasing the Anfield ticket prices the day after the transfer deadline day when they had signed nobody on deadline day and the fans got so mad, me included, even though I live thousands of kilometers away from Anfield and I, I can't afford to go to Anfield regularly. I've been, in the, I've, I've been to Anfield in the past and I absolutely loved it. But, but what the owners did with the fans is nothing short of disgraceful and unacceptable. And I fully agree with that 77th minute walkout protest that... Uh, the spirit of Shankly and the Spion Cup uh, group, fan groups are uh, uh, organizing in the Liverpool Sunderland game. What do you think about this in the comments below? It's a topic that I feel very strongly about because I have been a Liverpool fan for 16 years and I spent my hard earned cash on merchandise and everything else many, many times. And I've been to Anfield, I've watched Liverpool in the Champions League, and uh, I know that so many fans are prized out basically of watching their favorite team week in week out there are some fans who have been watching Liverpool since they were five every week at Anfield and now they can't afford to pay for the increased ticket prices basically what they what they announced is basically it was a lot of PR bullshit because uh, in their announcement FSG and the club focused on the minority of tickets that got cheaper and also the 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 youth uh, ticket uh, scheme which which basically is that you can get a ticket for for nine pounds but that, that is only 0 0.5 percent of the whole tickets basically and for only three games of next season and that they focused on that mainly but they didn't mention that most of the tickets got a lot more expensive most of the season tickets also got a lot more expensive and uh, when liverpool and every club gets 40 million pounds more than this season for basically doing nothing with the increased tv deal they could have the the, the they only get two million pounds for increasing the ticket prices prices they get 40 million pounds with the increase of the TV deal and they had to do absolutely nothing to get that money and uh, they have been talking to Anfield uh, supporter groups, the Liverpool supporters group, um, Spirit of Shankly and others and uh, the supporter groups have been asking Liverpool not to increase the ticket prices for like more than 18 months. They have been in discussion and basically FSG said a big fat fuck you to the Liverpool fans. That's my opinion and that's also many of the Liverpool supporters opinion that I have read their, I've read their announcements, their, their uh, statements, the fans groups are so angry and they are perfectly right because the working class uh, people who support Liverpool and who have been the lifeblood of this club are being priced out of going to the games next season some of them are already basically saying that they can't afford to to pay for next season's tickets they can't afford to pay to renew some of them can't afford to pay, renew their season tickets because the season tickets some of them had have went up by 160 or 200 pounds the some of the tickets go for 77 pounds next season for category a games and and that's just too much that's just that's just too much and pure greed by the owners FSG and basically what their friend groups are saying that uh, the Liverpool employees and the Liverpool Football Club uh, were very very open about their suggestions but basically the decision was made in Boston the decision that this the decision to increase the ticket prices was made by the owners themselves and they ignored the fans calls they ignored the fans uh, uh, suggestions and and they are wanting to milk this club dry they want to milk the fans dry and also one of the big controversy controversies recently on their uh, on their management page the fan fanway sports management website they the the headline said 
we want to turn fans into customers, which is absolutely disgraceful. And some of the Liverpool fans, of course, uh, have found this and it was all over Twitter. Now they changed it the, to there is another headline now. I think they want to, the headline is now they want to turn um, uh, customers into fans. But it's unacceptable and I fully agree. And if you are going to Anfield against Sunderland, I really highly recommend you to walk out on minute 77. It's minute 77 because the highest ticket price is 77 pounds and it's not for a hospitality or anything else fancy. It's just for a regular Anfield seat in a category A game next season and that's just too much. That's just absolutely too much. And we don't want to turn Anfield into a rivalry. The, the, the atmosphere has been going downhill in the past five or six seasons and one of the big reasons is this that more and more tourists and more and more businessmen will go to Anfield and less uh, working class and less young fans will go to Anfield because of the increased ticket prices so I really hope that the protests work and the owners will do something about this because to get 40 million from the TV deal plus and to get and to get just two million more from the ticket prices that doesn't justify that small profit it's it's basically nothing for the club two million you can't even buy a decent player for that amount of money so it's not like they absolutely desperately need that money from the fans while in the Bundesliga the Bayern Munich games the Borussia Dortmund games cost something like 10 or 12 pounds compare that to the 50 60 77 pound tickets that they charge in England it's just terrible the game is is, is going uh, in the wrong direction in my opinion let me know what do you think about this I had to make this video guys sorry if it's no interest to you but I feel very strongly about this so let me know what do you think in the comments below and leave a like if you enjoyed this thanks for watching see you later guys goodbye